General Hospital's Valerie teases that Michael Garanja and Drew Gang will be living town together to take care of something. More precisely, Michael and Drew will make a few deals related to ELQ, something both of them have talked about a lot during last time. Meanwhile, Ned Quarterman is very impatient when he learns that the two of them have a mutual agreement. Ned will definitely have to find a way to stop this deal, because if the deal is successful, Ned may no longer be a member of ELQ company. At that time, Ned will lose all of Ned's management rights at ELQ. If that is true, Ned will fall into despair. Because he didn't want to stand by and watch himself being pushed out of ELQ, Ned follow Michael and Drew to find a way to stop this. Is it likely that Ned will commit a new crime targeting the two of them? Which is exactly when Ned, when Ned wants Michael and Drew to stay there forever. Ned is generally known to be a good person and has never caused anything bad, and he has never intended to target anyone. However, everything will quickly change when Ned's life is affected by other people. Another part is that Ned's personality may change after Ned regains his memory. Tracy Quarterman has always been someone who often commits dirty act in secret. Few people know that Tracy has support behind her. Maybe behind Tracy, there is a huge force that is urging Tracy to take action every day. That's why it's likely that Tracy will step in to help Ned in the near future. Tracy Man Purples is likely to take down those or planning to eliminate Ned. Of course, Tracy also loves and is willing to protect her son. If Ned is the same Ned as before, this means that Ned has regained his memory and Ned has also returned to business as Tracy wanted. Thus, Tracy had almost come with trust in Tracy's son. Therefore, Tracy will certainly influence this matter to prevent the possibility of Ned being removed from ELQ. Tracy then had a conversation with Ned, and here Tracy was startled by Ned's surprising statement. Specifically, Ned told Tracy a meaningful statement about not wanting to see Michael and Drew again. Of course, Tracy understood the implications of the statement, and the next day Tracy soon prepared a plan to make everything happen according to Ned's wishes. With this incident, it is certain that Tracy will soon have an attack on Michael and Drew. In order to this happen successfully, Tracy secretly order a few assassins who target Michael and Drew. That was right around the time Ned got behind them and reported their locations to Tracy. If their plan succeed. Michael and Drew may end up being in prison there, or even the worst that could happen is that Michael and Drew would lose their lives here.